I was born in Minneapolis, Kansas, and I graduated from high school, Minneapolis High School there, and I've always loved art, one way or another, but I never did really get into painting until later in my life, because I had school to go to and got a degree in art, and, and uh, got started in that way with, with the art world, and it just got deeper and deeper. I loved it. I love mostly the abstract art, uh, and I love landscapes. Uh, I always have. I've loved when we lived on a farm in out of Minneapolis, and in the winter, I mean in the summer, not the winter for heaven's sakes, but it was too hot to sleep inside. We'd go outside and my brothers and sisters and I would go out and we would sleep out in the yard with our blankets and whatever and watch the, the moon or the whatever was going on. I've loved art, I guess, ever since then. I just have always loved being out. I could say I'm an abstract artist. I love the landscape and it's been from childhood. It's something that, uh, it just moves me. I care about it a whole lot and I love to do landscapes that are, again, abstract but kind of way out yonder type of things. I just like to paint. Just, I see things that will move me in some way Oh, well, I think I'd like to do that. And flowers, I love flowers, and like to paint those. And I have painted after we moved down to the Gulf Coast, and we saw a lot of water. I would paint water when there were storms and boats, you know, in the water, things. It just kind of depended upon where we were and what my husband and I, and uh, what I felt like doing. Animals intrigue me, and if I see animals in a way that I would like for them to be made happy or whatever, that's it. <laughs> I like oils, and I like watercolor, and I like uh, any of it, really. And it just kind of depends on the mood, I guess, at the time. But uh, I paint now with acrylics a lot because I like it, it's easy to work with, and it's easy to clean, clean up the mess I make now and then. And I can be very loose with it, which I like to be. And color, it has some wonderful colors, and I can work with those. And I use a lot of uh, heavy canvas. And I do my own canvas covering and, you know, do that. But when I buy, uh, like, I want to do something with paper, I do that and, and uh, get it ready for painting and go from there. <laughs> That's the way I see things a lot of times. And it may not be realistic, but it, to me, what I'm looking for is is whatever it is that I create.